So I just finished my paddle, man. I was due to be coming back for the demonstration on Saturday. There's something I haven't told everyone. I had an incident quite a few weeks ago with an arson. Um, I do have the video of everything, but it was targeted against against my property. Well, not against my property, against my wife's property. Um, at that point, we left the country straight away. And I'm looking at relocating my family, which is pretty hard to do. And especially with COVID, because I couldn't even get a hotel. Trying to get a hotel, couldn't even find a hotel to move them out to. So, obviously, my wife has had enough of everything. Um, someone gave us somewhere to stay, so we left the country. And I was due to be flying back for the demonstration. Obviously, now with this 14-day quarantine, if I fly back, I probably won't get back out. My kids are out here. I'm still in the process of finding the permanent relocation for them. I've got new schools for my daughters. But that's just an update. Look at me. Look at that. Oh, mate. So, uh, I'm playing paddle. It's great. It's a mix between tennis and squash. But I'm sorry. That's just so I'm letting people know because when I couldn't be back, people said, what, he's still away? Because my family away, because I need my family to be away because they're not safe, basically. And it wasn't Muslims that done this. Um, it was after all the BLM stuff. I think I know who it was. So that's just an update. I will... I tried to go live. The reception shit where I am. I'll keep... I'll go live tomorrow night or something. But that's just letting you all know I won't be there. The demonstration's still on. I'll be doing a speech. It's still on outside in London for Hearts of Oak. But that's just an update for me to say, unfortunately... I've got my flights booked, but because they've changed the regulations on COVID bullshit, I won't be able to come back. And I would come back, but my kids and family are out here, so I literally drove out here with them. Peace.